Hey there, are you interested in shooting music videos in 2023 but don't know where to start? Well, this is my personal guide on how to shoot and how to start shooting music videos in 2023 and be successful. Hi there, my name is Desmond. I've been shooting music videos for going on three years now. I am a director and editor. I am the owner of a video production company and I just want to share with you guys some tools and some tricks uh, that you can take on your next video or your beginning video if you're starting out on this and level up and maybe just start out knowing how to shoot and have a creative mindset behind it. A lot of music videos nowadays can be cookie cutter, especially a lot of just starter out run and gun videos where there's uh, not a lot of budget behind it. They can really be basic and I want to show you guys when starting out how to stand out and you know be seen through that crowd of, of other videographers that are just you know shooting these cookie cutter basic videos. So. I want to take you guys on set of one of my recent shoots, show you guys some behind the scenes stuff, and just break down to you guys the creative process, how we shot things, how the footage came out, and explain to you guys the mindset going behind these different setups, so you can get a gist of how to shoot music videos. In general, this was a low budget video, so something that you would definitely be handling once you start out. Uh, most most people starting out don't do high budget videos so this one right here is a low budget video so don't let the the, the high tech gear on behind set for you this was a low budget video um and i just want to like i said express to you guys and show you guys a couple tricks and things that help you improve your mindset and make cool videos in 2023 so without without further ado let's get started Starting off, you want to make sure you get anything that um, needs setting up, set up. If you can afford to um, have an hour um, before the artist arrives, it's always best to do so to get everything set up. Um, typically, when starting off, you'll have a, um, a low budget type rig, something like the Sony Alpha 6400, which I shot on for majority of the two years um, starting off. Um, you usually don't need a lot of setting up time, so if you're if you have some some gear that needs setting up, definitely do that before the artist arrives. You want to have everything set up so when the artist arrives, all you have to do is just discuss um, the position of him in the shot, the shot ideal if you if it's some dialogue and stuff like that along with it, and um, just set up your camera settings primarily, making sure your camera, your ISO, and all that good stuff is dialed in to where when you're ready to hit that record button, um, the artist has only been there for maybe ten minutes. And you're ready. <laughs> The next thing I want to talk to you guys about is something that you should take with you on every video shoot. It's called complementary colors. Complementary colors are exactly that. They're colors that complement each other. They're typically secondary colors on the color wheel. And if you choose one of those colors and then select the exact opposite color of that color on the color wheel, they complement each other. You see this in movies like The Joker or Alice in the Wonderland. Um, complementary colors are used <clears throat> everywhere. And so for this particular video, we chose the orange and blue color scheme. And that's primarily because in the studio, they already had fixed blue lighting. So to complement that fixed blue lighting, we chose a reddish orange um, light that we threw one behind the camera you see here. And then for this shot, one right to my left in the booth with the artist that is creating that nice orange um, teal dynamic on his face, um, which is really beautiful and it, and it complements each other. So just try to take this in mind when you're shooting, um, if you can use fixed lighting or controlled lighting make sure the colors are can complement each other so for like this scene right here um we choose we chose a basic spotlight because in post i'm gonna uh change the color um grade of this particular clip to black and white so that single spotlight is going to be the next thing i want to talk to you guys about is knowing which angles work at which time i remember starting off at a, as a as a young videographer and uh not knowing what to shoot and like how to direct the subject in certain lighting in certain situations. So um, it took a lot of time to study and learn the variety of different angles and shots and different moves that require different different setups. So um, after a while, you will begin to learn these things. But starting off, um, it, yeah, it becomes very overwhelming. So I do recommend one thing, and that is shooting from the shadow side. And shooting from the shadow side, what that is, is it uh, means that you want to be on the same shot of your subject as the shadow. Um, it produces some crazy effects, and some it has some added benefits. Um, the backlit hair will glow from the sun or the light that you have, like in the uh, in the room that I'm shooting with. I have a light shining on him, and you'll see here in a second um, an example of that backlit light um, shining into the camera that um 
create some really nice flares and it also allows your subject not to have to look into the camera and squint because of the very bright eyes like here in this shot you can see i'm shooting on the shadow side and that light is creating a very nice flare as well as that depth of um that depth of field that is added in his face because of those shadows and the multiple lights and that angle of filming so it's definitely something i recommend that you learn starting off or just take with you um because it will create some very cinematic and um very nice pleasing shots when you're capturing performances and um vocal performances of your artists you know for the music video so, so the next thing i want to talk to you guys about is not being afraid to be a director i remember starting out not really knowing how to command a set um, it could be different telling people what to do or having to tell the subject, hey, I need you to be here for this to happen or I need you to pose or you should do this action and it'll look good on camera. You know, it, um, it could really be um, different if you're not used to, you know, having authority and most of us aren't. So I want to give you guys a little um, four minute segment to show you guys exactly of some raw behind the scenes um, how, you know, I am at directing now. So maybe you can take something from that and uh, understand why exactly um you know, I get compliments like this after filming with, with clients. Foreign Sound Studios, appreciate get it, my boy. Appreciate Best videographer in the industry. Appreciate you, appreciate you. He said it, not me. You know? <laughs> yeah, that's something, I, you know, all of us can attain as videographers. So without further ado, here's the behind the scenes so you can see exactly why. Yeah, um, in the booth joint or yeah. the one that, the intro I sent you? In the booth joint, in the booth joint. And okay. then, what I'm thinking is after that, we'll get some B roll maybe of y'all to just like, you know what I'm saying? Work, seeming like y'all working on the song together to throw in the mix with the, with the performer junk. And then I'm gonna come in and set that back drop up. We're gonna do that scene. So that's what we look forward to next, gentlemen. Yeah. <laughs> right on. Step in the booth. Maybe uh, I'm gonna get a. I'm gonna switch out lenses. We can get one more shot in here, and then that'll be it. Yes, sir. Yeah, sir. Just like getting to be able to stand in the light for a while now. Lately, <laughs> that was perfect, everybody. Just think we should be good on this shot, man. We'll take next. We just wanna get some B-roll, of y'all doing. Getting out third picture, right? Yeah, pretty much. You, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> for sure. It's y'all two, just you know what I'm saying. What about y'all formulating the beat and uh, the track together? Pretty much, you know, you know the other stuff. Let's go with it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that yeah, was going, guys. I would say, man, we can take a little break real fast while we set up the backdrop. Get the backdrop set up in here, man. We're going to kill these lights when I get everything set up. And what I'm going for, man, you think you can speed that up two times as fast for me? What, the song? Yeah, like exactly two times as fast. And if you think you can rap it two times as fast. <laughs> oh, yeah. Okay, perfect. Because what I'm going to do is I'm gonna drop the frame rate on this camera, put it in slow mo. And uh, have it to where when I put it in post, mm -hmm. everything's moving slowly, but your lips are still synced up with the beat. You see mm -hmm. what I'm saying? And I'm gonna have a light swaying above your head to where that light kind of exacerates that. So you can really see like, oh, that light's moving slow, but yeah. how it's brilliant, you know what I'm saying? Rapping at the same pace as, as, as a track, pretty much. That's hard. So that's you can do that. That's some oh, triple X type shit. You can do it on this ass part. That's, 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 that's what I'm saying. I was gonna do it up there too as well, man. <laughs> exactly, so hey, you got the right thing. You want it exactly twice exactly as fast. Exactly twice as fast. Yeah. That's fast as fuck. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. You know what I'm saying? You gotta you gotta hit it, man. You, gotta, you gotta play it a couple times and chipmunk it a little bit, man. Practice, you know. Give me about ten minutes, I'm gonna have this backdrop set up, so we're gonna practice it. You know what I'm saying? Right. I'm thinking I might even go a little bit tighter, switch out lenses real fast. Get like a nice and then I'm going to have you kill this light here inside of the fleet. Oh, God. So you should be good to go. Ladies and gentlemen. <clears throat> All right. You ready? Yeah, I hope so. <laughs> <laughs> it's gonna, you know what I'm saying? It's going to be quick, but uh, we're going to do most of the takes. So you ain't got to worry about messing up, man. I got you. All right. All set. All right. Let's get it. So we're just gonna do, you know what I'm saying, one more time for redundancy, just so we know we got some nice clean takes. Sure. And uh, because it is very rapid, so I know it's hard to hit everything. So this is just so you know, we got a good mix of everything. Yeah. You hitting the good majority of everything, you know. 
I don't know. You got the souvenir back. You know what I'm saying? It's about to be crazy. But now, brother, if you want to, man, um, let's go ahead and get dressed, bro. Get into the uh, military uniform. And then, uh, Too easy. We'll head to that train station, please. If you want to show me that real fast, can you point to me? So I hope you guys can take something from that, you know, and really show up on set starting off um, and really command the set as a director, you know. So it's, it's really essential. <laughs> Okay, guys, I just wanted to show you guys that and uh, uh, express those ideas and concepts and just help you guys, you know, navigate and understand basically how to, how to start shooting music videos. Um, like I said, it, it doesn't take a lot. Don't let the fancy gear fool you. It doesn't take a lot to start off and make money off of this. Um, you really can just take certain tools, certain, certain ideas and creative paths to really enhance your your filmmaking and your, your your creative abilities with the camp. So if you just take these steps and apply them to your videos, I guarantee you, you will see some type of difference or just starting out you 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 will be above the bar when shooting music videos compared to other people. I've been shooting music videos full time for about a maybe two years now. So it it, it really doesn't take much to get started and starting making money off of filming and using the camera and to make music videos. So like I said guys, this is Something I'm gonna do more often. Just wanted to express you guys, you know, this, whatever this is. So, hey, appreciate you. Take it easy. I don't know what I'm doing. This is the first video. It's probably gonna be cringe later, but um, I love you. No, I don't. I don't know you. Hey, take it easy. <laughs>